Good morning, Chickadoes and Chickadees. Today is Monday, November 16th, and this is your lesson video. So if you take a look at the WAG that we get a glance for this week, the focus is your TED Talk speech. So last week, you were given time to write your introduction, do your, your topic proposal, thesis proposal. I was able to get back to most of y'all. Um, as you still keep bringing them in, I will look at them and return them to y'all. And then y'all had time to work on your body paragraphs. Remember, the minimum it needed is a Tolman style paragraph. So I know we're still working on that structure, but really focus on providing two instances of evidence, two very specific accounts of what that idea looks like, what that reason looks like. So really adhere to the T structure, topics and its evidence analysis. Um, but with the evidence part, there's two pieces of evidence that you are discussing. There are two pieces of evidence that you are providing as support to the reason that you're providing in the topic sentence. And then finishing off that paragraph with your rebuttal or refutation, you know, acknowledging the other side, seeing what they have to say, what they would be a naysayer about, and then either shooting them down or explaining how you are more so correct, how they should see your side instead. Okay, so ex like as I discussed before, that paragraph will be lengthy. It's a T paragraph on steroids, so there's a lot to it. So I would expect at least you know three quarters of a page or more on that. So if we look at the WAG for today, and again this is located in the week five folder. Today is a reading day, so that you can pull your three sentences from the Great Gatsby. Today, the focus, if again, if you need that guidance, some of y'all are ahead, some of y'all behind, but if we're keeping on track, I'm providing this as guidance. If you want to use today as a reading day, I would focus on chapter three and then pulling your three sentences. If you get to focus on one sentence and then do the analysis for it, then great. But if all you can do today is just read and pull, document your three sentences, then you're fine. If you would rather use this day as a writing day, you, know, you can read chapter three later because the syn syntactical portfolio is not due until after Thanksgiving break, you know, back on uh, next on December 4th. Um, but you can definitely use this day as a writing day if you choose, whether it's to continue building your body paragraphs or not. But I would focus on your conclusion, focus on that appeal to the audience, that sense of closure, uh, that final talk with them. All right, if you have any questions, I'll be on. I'm gonna do another video to talk about what I want for the Great Gatsby's syntactical portfolio. Love y'all, have a good day and make good choices. Bye guys.